Hey guys, so if you want to change the wallpaper on your phone, you just need to go to the settings and in the settings you will get this customization and then you need to click and select the wallpaper to change the wallpaper. But now you don't need to do anything like that. You just need to pull your MSV GTS to mini, come to the music player and just click on the buttons to change the wallpaper by itself. So this is the first one, this is the second one and this is the third one hey guys back with another video for my addictive blogging channel so this will be an amazing video guys because in this video we will see how we can connect our msp gts to mini with the tasker app in our phone not only that we can also change the wallpapers in our phone with only one click of a button in msp gts to mini so we will see the whole process in this video and as always this video will be a sick video guys and if you are taken to see asked don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because I will be making more videos like this. So let's start. So for this we need two apps. One is the notify app which is the third party app for the MS Fit watches. You will get this app on the play store itself. And another app we need is the tasker app which is also available in the play store i will leave the links of both the apps in the description itself and once you have downloaded these two apps you just need to configure the tasker app with the right triggers and the right buttons at the right time so now first let's open the notify app and you need to connect the zap app and the notify app with the msv gts to mini first after you have connected it you just need to come to this option in this option you will get this button and in the button option you just need to click on notify button here in the play pause action button you just need to click on it and select the option of tasker so what it will do is it will link the action button that is the play pause button with the tasker action whichever we will configure in the tasker app itself similarly in the next track action option also you need to select the tasker action option and previous track and volume up action also you need to select the same task action so once you have done all this you just need to click on the button option again and in the notify button you will get this tasker help option so here we will get the intent codes or triggers which will be used to receive the triggers from the buttons of msv gts to many so as we will be configuring the play pause and the next track and the previous track and the volume up button options we need to select the proper intent codes from this list so once we are in the tasker help option we need to scroll down and select the music play pause event use intent code from here just click and copy this code and now come to the tasker app once once you are in the tasker app you just need to click on this plus sign under profiles and here you need to click on create then you need to click on this event option in the event option you will get numerous options you need to click on the system so in the system you will get this intent received option so here we need to put the intent code which we have already copied and once we have made the intent code here just click on back and you will see it will ask you to create a new task click on this new task option and click on this tick sign after you click on that you will get this option of task edit and in this click on plus and just scroll down and select the option to change the wallpaper from the msv gts to mini so for that we need to select the display option here so in the display option you will get numerous options you need to select set wallpaper after you click on set wallpaper you just need to select the image which will be changed when you will be changing the wallpaper so to do that you just need to click on the search symbol go to the gallery and in the gallery you need to select the picture which you want to be changed or wallpaper you want to set at that time so let's select this one and once you have done that just click on back button and here click on ok so we have already set one intent which will change the wallpaper if we will be clicking on the play pause button so i have already created all the intents with the intent codes for other buttons also so here if we go for the next track option i have done the same similar actions here and in the action i have selected the picture which will be changed with the button click here 
also i have selected the proper intent code so for next track button the intent code you need to select again from the notify app and here the intent code is music next event use just click and copy this intent code for next track button option in the ms3 gts2 mini which will change the wallpaper and paste it in the event edit option so for next track i have selected the proper intent code here this is for the previous track i have again selected the same intent code from here for previous track just copy and paste this intent code and paste it on the task wrap and in the action again i have selected the picture which will be changed for the previous track button we, we will be pressing it on our msv gts2 mini so i have selected all the intent codes properly and this one i have selected to show you guys so i will disable this as already i have made the intent code for play pause button here so, so once you have done and created all the task with the proper intent codes here you just need to click on this tick symbol which will save all the profiles up here and once you have done all this you just need to come to the notify app again and here you need to enable all the options for play pause next track and also the previous track and the volume up action and the volume down if you want to set for volume down also you can enable that i have selected for these four options here and once we have done all the settings properly just you need to open the music player app in your msv gts2 mini and make sure you are connected with the notify app also the tasker app is running on the background and the zap app is also connected with your msv gts2 mini and now you can change the wallpaper from your msv gts2 mini which will reflect on your phone so now let's see whether this is working or not so just click on this play pause button and see the wallpaper is getting changed or not here so yes if we click on the play pause button the wallpaper is getting changed again in the next track it is getting changed and on the previous track also it is getting changed so all the options or intents which we have created with the triggers are working properly and changing the wallpaper in our phone so in order for this to work properly make sure you have given all the permission to the tasker app itself because the tasker app will need the storage permissions as well as the permissions to receive the intent and triggers from the msv gts2 mini so it will just ask for permission the tasker app just you need to allow all the permissions whichever are required at that moment so this is the easiest way to change the wallpaper on your phone from the msv gts2 mini and also in this way you can connect the tasker app which is there for the android phone and also connect this app with the msv gts2 mini itself so that's it guys i hope you have liked this video if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because i will be making more videos like this so thank you guys have a great day thank you